Hello! So today I want to share with you how I started my snapdragon seeds and now that the seedlings have come up, how to fertilize. So I started my snapdragon seeds in the freezer. I put them in the freezer for 48 hours, planted them up, put them under my grow lights. My grow lights are in the furnace room, so it's quite warm conditions. And they say after the seedlings have started to move them into an area where it's 10 degrees Celsius. I do not have an area like that, like a garage or a cold frame. So hopefully this experiment will still work. I'll keep them under my grow lights. So now though that the seedlings have started, I've got my cotyledons. That's the first little leaves that you see, but they're not the first set of true leaves, which which come afterwards. The cotyledons eventually will yellow and fall off, um, but the first set of leaves indicate it's now time to fertilize. So what I've got here is a miracle Grow quick start. Um, what's key is the middle number. The middle number has to be higher because that's for phosphorus. And phosphor, bleh, can't speak. Phosphor, let me try it again. Phosphorus, um, is key to root development. It also helps the plant use and store energy. So um, that's why you want a, a middle number that's higher. Um, then the first number, nitrogen, um, is a four, and that's helpful in stimulating chlorophyll production, but also essential in uh, the production of proteins and uh, very helpful for development of leaves. Um, the last number, potassium, uh, is also a four, and that's um, a general um, plant health. So um, root and stem strength, but also um, helps the plant be resistant to diseases and cold and dry conditions. So I'll use this um, fertilizer at half strength, um, or you can even use a qu uh, quarter strength, which is also works. You don't want to put on too much. And then, because um, it's concentrate, um, so half strength um, with water, of course, follow instructions. And um, yeah, and I'll just um, pour it on, so twice a week, and hopefully this experiment will work. And I'll be able to use these um, plants out in my garden. So I'll just share with you though what um, kinds I got. Um, I often, this year, um, I wanted to get taller uh, plants. I always seem to get dwarf plants. I can't, can't find the taller ones. So these ones uh, are quite, quite a bit taller. So this is Potomac Pink. These can get up to 60 inches tall. So I love that. And then I've also got Solstice White. Um, which can get about 20 inches tall. So hopefully this experiment will work and I'll be enjoying snapdragons in my garden this year. Okay, till the next time. Bye!